hello uh, in this video series we'll be making a chat room app and uh, I'll show you a little demo before we start what we're going to do here's like one user is typing here how are you how are let's make another instance of some other user is sitting somewhere else their name is different they send a message and it's updating without refreshing uh, we'll be using ajax a little bit jquery and javascript php and uh, database so let's start our graphical user interface first make this div boxes and everything so close this close this now here's a document i have basic structure here in uh, this i have inserted the javascript jquery file already so here we'll put our css and here we'll write our script and in the body tag we'll start our div so first we will make box and then after in uh, sorry box and close the box that will be our full box of the chat in the box we will make another another in the box we'll make input actually input type text text name whatever name we can give this a name or maybe id as well and we will make one button with id of button one we will make two button actually so this button would be a career history history button then we will create another div for uh, chat text in, in this div we will put our chat and we can leave it empty here then create a input we'll copy and paste here this one and this button should be the send button send and we'll give id of chat and the name chat this will input type of our text button give id of two button so that's basic structure of our divs and uh, input so this is the result coming up here so let's style this now style our box first box give a width of maybe let's say 400 pixel maybe 400 pixel oh, sorry width and then we will say margin 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 of 0 and auto it will bring this into the center this div box in the center here and then 
we'll give it a border and a padding maybe maybe border of two pixel solid or maybe dotted and uh, gray there you go now let's go back to our chat text chat text the window where we will be put in our chat we'll be giving height height of uh, as if maybe 480 pixel pixel height yeah 400 pixel is enough yeah. and overflow auto you can say auto overflow it means when we have more chat it will be scrollable okay so that's for the chat text now let's handle the inputs and the buttons when we are done uh, input type is equal to text let's input type text so we will give a width maybe 300 pixel maybe 300 enough yeah 300 enough 300 pixel and give it a padding as well 10 pixel Ten is too much. Okay. Let's try eight. Five. Okay, five pixel padding. And border box sizing. Border box border radius five pixel border radius and then give a margin of ten pixel maybe. We can use the width of our actually okay, 425 and uh, background background color background color we choose F8 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 All right here yeah. Now let's style button button 1 and 2 button 1 let's say button 1 uh, with uh, or maybe padding don't worry about the width you can give a style whatever you want padding of 10 pixel maybe text color white and background color gray
Oh, hash. Oh, that's fine. No. Let's check it every dog. Oh, okay. We can increase the padding actually. We use 10 pixels, that's too small. Yeah. And if we're gonna give a border radius, we give a little bit border radius, maybe 4 pixels. Minor bit. And uh, button two for button two will say everything same but color is green but we have to give it a little bit because it's text is too small uh, width of 90 pixels that's enough yeah so that's uh, our styling finish.